Hey chat, welcome back. I'm working on my house. And um, if you know my house, you know I like to have a basement, right? Like a, an underground where there's a, a hole in the grass, if you want. A little crevice, I call it. And on top would be the real house, right? Um, we need a rock. Well, luckily, this is a this is a fun server, so we just get to choose something. Uh, this is a rock. So I came up with a system. You might already see from my my videos, or you can have me grab my shit here. You can have a bunker underground. You've seen it in videos. I wanted that to be a one by one. But personally, it's all in in a one by one. Uh, for a one by one, right? You do. You get the idea, right? You actually build here. You know what I mean. the gist of it I think but at the same time you have a little bunker system underneath the floor so there might be another way maybe I should look the bunkers up but I came up with uh, this bunker system I cleared those for you The one I used to have had an opening like this in the back as well, and I could put a half wall in the back here, which would support the triangle, the square, but not the other triangle right here. That's what we want. We, that's exactly what we want. Some extra space to build small walls to support that. That when we break it, it, it clears up. Uh, but the issue I was looking at was that when this side is a triangle and it's open, it's more ways for people to get in. Because the weak point of the basement system is the basement wall, right? Like, for example, if raiders decide to raid the base of the of the base the basement of the base right they destroy just this guy right here it clearly opens them up to the tc which is dumb it's completely dumb so if you have two sides like that it makes it more probable for basement raiders or base raiders or whatever floor uh to, to find it and then and, and be lucky and, and look out and say oh what is this as they destroy the, the foundation so we want to have as as little of that as possible even this side when you think about it, it it's wrong it's actually not helping so i'm gonna have to rethink and relook and things through because that's not what i want it's better of course <clears throat> than it was because if they figure out this is the front, they might hit it from the back. Right? So we, we don't want the back to be weak. So it is better, somewhat. Uh, but what ended up happening was that you... if With this system, which by the way, all foundations are rock and metal. Uh, and the walls are twigs. Okay, so if you're trying to figure out the layout, foundations are rock and metal, and the walls are twigs. So, another thing that I want, I don't want to put a wall here, 
because I want to pi pass a pipe. You can pass a pipe through the floor like this, but you can't pass a pipe through a wall like this. So if my wall could be somewhere else, here, I can still pass a pipe here through and seal that floor. It's possible. Then you get to plug this industrial and this industrial. And possibly have your machines down here so they don't make noise. Uh, but what I what what comes up now that this with this setup, it's another thing that is very particular, you can close it from inside, which you couldn't do before, because if you would put a wall here, you couldn't put a, a triangle I think up there, which maybe maybe not I can't remember. Now you can close it from outside, break it, get inside. Um, yeah, if I can put two walls and do the same thing, there's got to be a better way to do this. Right. We're going to work at it. And yeah, we can close it. From outside as well. Another thing that comes to mind is if you really like the small builds that don't show too much, you could just have this. Yeah. It's, as you can see, <laughs> I mean, I, I'm looking out. On the whole, you know, in, I don't know, it's, it's somewhere where people can't see you too well. I think there might be a base, like over there, you know, there might be another base there. People don't see you in this, this hole. So if you're, if you're able to find, you can't really tell there's anything here. You might tell there's a floor, <clears throat> and then somebody could, uh, you know, reinforce all of that. Um, yes, we have a bag inside. We're good. Boom, boom, boom. <clears throat> Not everybody would be able to tell what's really going on here. You know what I mean? Somebody could try to build, they can't, won't be able to build. Be like, what's going on? So it's just an, you know, kind of a, an idea of a way to, to make a small bunker system. And this is mostly raised, it's not totally flat to the ground, so we have enough space. I think we have space for a workbench. If we give ourselves a workbench. What is it, an item? Workbench 2. No, that doesn't fit. We can put a small box. Um, we could also put a small box there because we can leave easier. Uh, if the TC would be here. Might be a way to put a box, a workbench, a TC, and a bag. And a small box or two. strain just grab the material before you leave Pretty cool. just thought I would show that now we're gonna try and come up with uh, a bunker system 
that doesn't have as much like space inside or holes. Although I guess you this could be storage. This could be your box system. But um, my goal is still to make it harder. So I can make a basement that is really hard and then build my house over it as always. Pretty cool.